Good morning, gang. Today is Monday, September 14th. I hope you had an absolutely wonderful weekend, and I hope you're starting your week off on the right foot. Um, it's going to be a beautiful day today. Uh, yeah, so that's all I got. <laughs> I hope you're doing good. Let me know if you're not. Quick reminder. Um, Anything from last week should be done by now. So as you go into Google Classroom this morning, which you already are in, um, make sure that you click the Mark as Done button on any of the agenda posts from week one. You'll notice those are a little bit further down the stream now. And then any assignment posts in the assignment Dropbox. Make sure you click Mark as Done on all of those because you're done with everything and you want to start the week fresh and clean. So just make sure you're clicking Mark as Done. And then of course, anytime you finish your work, like when you finish today's activity, um, make sure you're clicking Mark as Done there as well. So on for uh, what we're going to be doing today. If you took, um, if you're learning from home and you're not going to be learning in person this week, make sure that you take a picture of your flag and then email me a picture of that flag or attach a picture of that flag or something. Um, but make sure you are submitting a picture of your flag so I can get that up in the room. It would be even better if you could drop it off at school, but I know that might not be realistic. If you're the group that's coming later in the week, be kiddos. Um, we'll turn the flag in then when you come on in later in the week, but everyone else will be collecting the flag in person today. Uh, today, what we're going to be doing, we're going to be doing a little bit learning about how we're going to learn about the world. We're going to learn a little bit something called the five themes of geography. So today we're going to start with um, just some notes and I know notes aren't the most exciting thing in the world. Um, the slides are available and then there's a screencast available as well where I explain what is on those slides. If the slides were enough I'd just give you a copy of the slides. Uh, but the slides aren't enough so we got to take a few notes. As you're taking your notes please write down words, key phrases, comments, connections, things like that but also you're going to be making some sketches to visualize each of the five themes. I go into a little bit more detail and explanation of what those sketches could look like or should look like um, and I give some examples but then there's a couple of other times when I'm not going to give any examples and you have to figure it out on your own. Use your noggin. That's what it's there for. Do a little critical thinking. Add a couple of wrinkles uh, to the old brain of yours. Uh, when it comes to taking notes, you should have this paper copy right here. If you do not have a paper copy, there is a digital version link that you can print. If you don't have a paper copy and you are unable to print, you are able to take these notes digitally, but that will be a little bit more tricky. There is a link to create a copy of the notes for you that you can type in, uh, and that is linked below in the agenda post. But really, you only want to be doing the digital notes if you don't have a paper copy and you can't print, uh, because this paper copy is going to be something we're just going to want to be using all year long. So, uh, when you're all done with the notes uh, and the screencast, there's a quick little Google form. It's just got like one or two really open-ended questions uh, just to kind of summarize and wrap everything up. So when you finish taking those notes after you finish watching the screencast, which again is linked below, uh, please make sure you finish up by clicking that Google form, entering in all the info, just telling me what you think. And that's really all we got for today. Um, I hope you're doing well. Uh, and if there's anything that I can do, any questions that you have, anything that you're wondering, please, please, please let me know. I uh, look forward to seeing y'all soon, talking to you sooner. And remember, be bold, be kind, and make good choices. See ya!